Welcome to the second part of inverse of functions. By the end of this lesson, you will be able to generate the inverse of functions or relations when it is given as graphs. So to be able to generate the inverse of function, you need to pick about five coordinate points, then switch the X and the Y values, and then you graph the switched uh, values back on the, the graph, and then you connect them with a the line. So I need to point out that the number of points that you are going to pick might actually depend on the, on the type of graph or on the shape of the graph. Example one, so we need to generate the inverse of this red parabola. So the first thing to do is to pick five points on this parabola. So that's our point one, point two, point three, point four, and point five. Let's label them. So this is point, the value of X is negative two and the value of Y is positive two. For this point, the value of X is negative one and the value of Y is also negative one. For this point, the value of X is zero, the value of Y is negative two. And for this point, the value of the X is positive one and the value of Y is negative one. And the fifth point, the value of X is two and the value of the Y is also positive two. Okay, so now we have all the five points. So we need to switch this point. So again, X becomes the Y and the Y becomes the X. So I write all the Y on the X. and all the x's on the y. So now we need to plot the switched point back on the graph. So this is point two, negative two. So x is the value of two and y is negative two. That's that point. Then x is negative one, y is negative one. That is, x is negative 2 and y is 0. That's this point. Negative 1, 1, and 2, 2. So now we need to join this point. Okay, that might not be perfect, but you can see that the green is now the inverse of the red parabola. So in this question, we are now asked to determine whether the original uh, relation that was given to us is a function. So we need to draw, a, we need to do the vertical line test. So if you know that the, the parabola is definitely a function. So this is a function. But when you look at the green line, if you draw a vertical line across it, the vertical line crosses the green line two times, so the inverse is not a function. So I want you to use this question to practice how to generate the inverse of function. So I need you to leave a comment and tell me whether the inverse that you generated is also a function. Thank you, and please remember to subscribe.